Hey YouTube peeps, I'm back with the Winter Freight Crate. And I'm super stoked about this because they always send great stuff. And if you're a truck driver and you're not getting a freight crate, there's a link in the description so you can go get a freight crate. Um, if you see my other video, I got the normal, you get a list of what is in the box. Um, I don't feel like I need to show you air fresheners and that type of thing again. Um, and the Breaker 1-9 merch that comes with, um, they always give us pens, things like that, you know. And when you're on the road, you know, pens are lost very easily. I have a cubby hole specific for pens in my truck, which obviously I'm not in my truck right now. It is break time. And... So, this month, we got another subscription to Mother Trucker Yoga, which is phenomenal. I know all of the dude truckers out there are like, I'm not doing yoga, I'm not going to have any, any part of it. I'm telling you, if your joints hurt, if your back hurts, do the yoga things. They're simple stretches. She probably <laughs> she probably will explain to you like I would explain to you. There are modifications for all of it. Obviously, it's designed to do the yoga in your truck. I promise it's worth it. We got coupons for Driver's Friend. And Breaker 1-9 is now being sponsored by... Break time with Road Pro. So, there's always advertisements, goodies. As you saw in the beginning of the video, I showed how it comes packaged. I love how, I love how they send the freight crate. I have a makeup subscription box that I get every month. And they're just like, here, we're going to throw this in the bag. And I'm like, can you at least make the packaging cool like Breaker 1-9 does? But apparently not. So, first thing on the list, and I tried to show this in my last video, but I had unpackaged the coffee and consumed it. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. Just kidding. But I wanted to show in this video how they actually send their packaging. I love their packaging. The fact that they take the time to do this means that they're using their brains. I got to meet them. They did a... Kind of a promotional thing you know to get the brand out there at a and a truck stop in jackson ohio right off of 35 i got to meet these guys in person <laughs> they had tim horton's coffee and donuts not that i don't guess tim horton's really has anything to do with it but they brought coffee and goodies um they're fantastic people they're just, they're great. Um, so shout out to the Breaker One Nine peeps because you guys are great, great, great people. Um, but this is how, this is how they package the coffee. When they send you coffee in a can, and I say they send coffee in a can, but there are options you can, if you prefer energy drinks, they will, there are brands that, work with them that are energy drinks but i'm a coffee drinker not an energy drink drinker and if you sign up for the freight crate they that's a question that is asked in the survey is do you prefer coffee or do you prefer energy drinks so i get coffee and it is wrapped up in this pretty little package with a sticker and i have no idea which end this is going to come out oh i got the top okay so it's going to be upside down for a minute it is I'm not even going to try to butcher this. I'm not going to try to butcher that. A lot of the coffee that they send me is low carb. Um, I know that is a thing on the road. My dad was a diabetic. I know a lot of drivers that are diabetic. So a lot of the stuff that they send, it has been zero to very low carbs as far as the coffee's that, that I've received. Um, 
and usually they're pretty awesome. This is not, this is just black coffee, so I'm not 100% positive on this. I usually like coffee with my cream and sugar, but I'm going to give it a shot because I tried the last two and I like them. Um, I'm not a fan of cold coffee, but the, the last few t brands of cold brew coffee they've sent have been pretty good. Um, in the survey, when you sign up for the crate, they ask a lot of questions as far as your preferences go. So they really, really, really like to customize the box to, as far as the food items, they ask if you have allergies. Again, they ask if you prefer coffee to energy drinks or, or vice versa. Um, you have the option to get extra snacks, which I do because obviously I like to eat. I mean, but anyway, so that's the coffee. And we're saving the best thing for last. We got Black Hawk. Black Canyon. Sorry, my bad guys. Black Canyon. Um, mechanics gloves. And thankfully they sent me a good size because these fit my hands. I know I have been given work gloves. I have tried on work gloves and as a chick driver i have small hands so i can't just go grab a pair of leather work gloves somewhere and they fit fueling with leather work gloves is impossible um i had to go find women's gloves because the issued here's you a pair of leather gloves are like this much too long on my fingers so these are great because these fit my hands um that's another thing they will that's part of the survey is, you know, like what size shirt do you wear? So when we send merchandise and like I said in my last video, I got, I have gotten stuff from Hammer Lane. I have Breaker 1-9 shirts um, at the meet and greet. Um, I got a t-shirt from Breaker 1-9. Um, also in this freight crate, which I don't have on my person in my bedroom, it's actually in my truck. I got a mask. That is a that has the Breaker One Nine logo on it. I love it because it's soft and it's black and it matches ninety nine percent of what I wear on the road. Um, so there's these, and you know, I mean, gloves are gloves, and they're not really. It's a different material on the back, so they're stretchy, and then it's a faux leather grip, so it's grippy. It'll do what you need to do. It'll break some seals and pump some fuel. I, next thing. Okay, guys, I hate mushrooms. I absolutely, positively loathe mushrooms. Can't stand them. Every now and then, you'll catch me on a weird day and I will eat a breaded, fried mushroom. But usually only one or two of them and they have to be really crispy on the outside i hate mushrooms hate them so when i saw what was coming in this box i was a little nervous not gonna lie because how in the world a company could have achieved what they have <laughs> what they have managed here amazes me mushroom jerky so we have the OG, and I hope this is really, this is probably backwards in this video. It is Pan's Mushroom Jerky. This is the original flavor. It's shiitake, shiitake mushrooms. And what is in this is organic dried shiitake mushrooms, water, avocado oil, organic coconut sugar, Himalayan pink salt, and dried chia seeds. So... I couldn't come on here and do this video without having tried this business right here. So I opened this one first. I was terrified and I tried it. And the texture of this is insane. It's like beef jerky, but softer. Um, I was blown away. To say the least. And my hair looks like I stuck my finger in a light socket. Blown away by this. 
So there's the original. And then there's this. The salt and pepper flavor. This is my favorite. And I saved, I saved it. I tried one piece so I could come on here and do the video. Um, they're organic mushrooms. That's it. I mean, you know, most things you get, you can't read the ingredients on. It's just dried mushrooms and salt and pepper. Um, this is my favorite flavor. So I'll probably eat the other one and save this one for last. But, um pans you guys are rocking this i don't know who who decided they were going to dehydrate some mushrooms and make jerky out of it but kudos to you because i hate mushrooms i love this stuff now on to the end all be all of this winter freight crate um when i got the notification in my email for what was coming in the freight crate I went on to their website, not Breaker19, but the people that make this thing. I went on to their website trying to figure out what it exactly was that, that I was being sent. And I couldn't dare. They have battery packs. They have phone chargers. They have earbuds. They have all this stuff. And so I, I found a couple of things that I thought maybe were what I, what was coming. And dear Tough Tested, if you see this, or if anybody works for Tough, Tough Tested and happens to see this video, I apologize because I butchered this box because I was super excited when I got it. I had to get it out and make it available to be able to get out for the video. And when I get home off the road, when I go to my mailbox, <laughs> it's like Christmas because I get my freight crate, I get my makeup subscription stuff obviously when i'm on the road i'm ordering stuff online like i'll see advertisements and i'm like oh i want that and so when i come home it's like i have a truckload of stuff at the post office that i'm like oh, yay christmas in january so this tough tested transformer x it is a set of earbuds that are bluetooth it comes with a boom mic and when I, the reason I apologized for what I did to the box, because this is what I did to the box. Um, I've had a couple people say that they have shied away from the Breaker 19 Freight Crate because of the price. And I will tell you that every quarter that I get a Freight Crate, it pays for itself. If you look this up versus what you paid for the freight crate, all the other stuff included, extra snacks, coffee, whatever it is, plus the Breaker 1-9 merch that you get. Whatever company they are being sponsored by or working with for that quarter's freight crate comes through 110%. And if you look this up on Tough Tested, Tough Tested's website and look how much this thing is, you'll be like, what? I thought it was something else, and so I thought it was a different price. And when I got the freight crate, I looked this thing up, and I was like, oh, it's that. So, there's this, and we're going to finish destroying this box again so I can show you what all it comes with. So this is it out of the box. You get the little ear squishies so you can change the size of the earbud. So these little rubber digis are interchangeable, obviously. This is soft and squishy, so when you stick it in your ear, it's not stabbing you. It's got the nylon wrapped power cable or connector you know it goes around the back side of your neck there's the boom mic which is phenomenal obviously your volume answer and hang up buttons are on that 
which I can't, I'm not going to take it out of the container because it's wired in there. I just, I wanted to get it out of the box when I got it out of the mailbox because I couldn't wait. And then when I did get it out of the box, I had stuff falling all over me. Your power cord. And this fancy little storage case. Or your fancy little Bluetooth headset that they have sent you. And without going into pens and more just packaging in general, this is why I get the freight crate. And there's a possibility that I may be changing my position in the future, in the very near future. And I think I'm going to continue to get this just for the simple fact that I love all the little goodies that I get. That said, with the new position that I may have, if I get the job, there is a good possibility that for Driver Appreciation Week, I'm going to hit Breaker 19 up for freight crates for my drivers so that's how much i like it that's how much i like these people the customer service at at breaker one nine is absolutely phenomenal i i mean like i said i'm a sucker for subscription boxes hands down these people are the greatest the greatest i love their faces um and if you know me personally you know that if i say i love your face i really mean i love your face um in this little bag, also, is this fancy little clip with your power cord. So, you can attach your earbuds to things to, to not be like me and lose them. Because I would lose my head if it weren't physically attached to my body. So, and then you have your little cord. Look, my phone is not going to cooperate. Come on. Your little cord separate. I don't know if you can see that or not. It's a cord separator, so you can clip it. I guess I should show you. The cord goes in this little sandwich. Maybe. Maybe it doesn't. It's not going to cooperate because I'm, my headset is still in my box. But there's that. So there's lots of fancy gadgets that come with this fancy little headset. And the fancy little headset is definitely worth what I paid for the freight crate. So if you doubt that or question that, it's absolutely worth it. Um, if you check out my other video, you'll see the other really super cool thing that I got in the spring freight crate. Um, I love that thing. <laughs> Uh, I haven't had to use it for anything, but I, I love it. It was like Christmas. It's like Christmas every time. Every quarter when I get my freight crate, it's like Christmas because I know there is some cool stuff in here. Um, and it's a great community. They're, they're, you know, it's a new company, so they're building, they're, they're working on building their, their customer base. If you are a driver, it is absolutely worth subscribing to this. If for no other reason, then they have introduced me to brands that I had zero idea existed, which is part of the purpose of a subscription box. And then there's the fact that it is geared towards drivers. If you are a female driver, they cater to that as well. I mean, I'm me and... They're just, they're fabulous. It's its an ingenious idea. I mean, who else do you know caters? I mean, truck stops don't even cater to truck drivers. Who are we kidding? So that's that. That is the 2021 winter freight crate that I received in early January. But I happened to be on the road or this would have come out sooner. And I may have taken it 
and done the video like I did in my last video and done it in my truck, but I'm at home, so it's more comfortable at home. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Again, there's a link to get to Breaker 1-9 to get to the Freight Crate to subscribe in the, in the bottom underneath. You guys know what I'm talking about. You know, link in the description. You know, like, subscribe, all that jazzy stuff. I don't know. I'm not a YouTuber. I just, I'm trying to spread the word for these super awesome people. I'm not sponsored. These people aren't paying me to do this. I don't, you know, want money. I really just, I, I don't make YouTube videos for any other thing, but I really like these people. And I really, really, really think that, like, a lot of drivers should subscribe to this. Okay, maybe if you're a local person, it may not be quite as cool because you get to go home every night. But it's not even that. I mean, like, it's stuff that every driver can, can use and get down with. Like, they haven't sent me anything that I'm not like, yes, this is awesome. And it all goes to my truck. And I use it or munch on it or drink it. 